Christine Hopkins, local author and Galveston expert, and we're highlighting Dickens on the Strand. Dickens on the Strand is always scheduled the first weekend in December and is coordinated by the Galveston Historical Foundation. It was started nearly 40 years ago as a way to bring attention to restoring this beautiful historic area of Galveston. And it was called Dickens Evening on the Strand and was an evening event only. Now it's a three day festival and it kicks off on Friday night and continues through Sunday. The festival offers seven stages of entertainment all throughout the district. You'll enjoy holiday performances by choirs, handbells, pipes, and even cirque performances. And Dickens is for the entire family. There's a petting zoo, there's a children's area, and something you don't see every day in Galveston, a snow yard. And we encourage you to get into the spirit of Dickens on the Strand and dress in costume. Those in costume receive a discount on their admission tickets. And make sure you find a great spot to watch the Queen's Parade. The Queen's Parade is scheduled on Saturday and Sunday at 2 o'clock. And if you're here on Saturday evening, you can catch the Pickwick's Parade at 6.30 p.m. So one of the must at Dickens on the Strand is the Scotch Egg. It's a boiled egg covered in sausage, breaded with breadcrumbs, and deep fried. Let's check it out. And the line is long, but it's going to be worth the wait. Well, that's it for Dickens on the Strand. We hope you include this on your December itinerary during your next visit to Galveston. Remember to book your getaway early with Rice and Vacation Rentals. Ryson offers more than 250 vacation rentals all over the island, including near this historic Strand District. For more details, visit the link in the description. Be sure to like and subscribe to our page to see more vacation rentals and to keep up with all things vacationing on Galveston Island.